Welcome to King's College Hospital, Denmark Hill. We care for over 8,500 women, pregnant people and babies per year. We provide all aspects of obstetric and midwifery care, from preconception, conception, to antenatal, which is pregnancy, labour, to postnatal care, which is after the birth. This walkthrough video will show you key maternity services and explain what support is offered throughout your pregnancy and afterwards. Antenatal appointments are held at a variety of locations, both in the community and at the hospital, including children's centres, health centres, and a number of buildings on the King site, including Harris Birthright Centre, Stork on the Hill, Community Midwife's House, and Community Midwife Centre. Antenatal care is provided by the midwifery team caring for you in your local area, alongside your GP, and if indicated, our obstetric team or other healthcare professionals. Pregnancy and birth can be experienced in a wide variety of ways, so an individualised approach will be taken when considering your options for birth and preparing for your baby and all that comes with parenthood. During your pregnancy, you will have regular appointments to make sure you and your baby are well. We also offer support with booking appointments and a range of antenatal education to help prepare you with caring for yourself and your baby. The Harris Birthright Centre is well known for its research and treatment on unborn babies. Here you'll have all of your routine scans and be seen by a number of the team such as sonographers, doctors, midwives, support workers and our admin team. When you enter the building you will see the security desks and lifts on your left. Scanning suites are located on the second floor. King's routinely offers three ultrasound scans during pregnancy. You may also have extra scans arranged, which will be based on your clinical need, which is assessed at booking and throughout your pregnancy. The maternal assessment unit is at the back of the antenatal clinic on the ground floor. This is where you'd come if you required urgent care during your pregnancy and the maternal assessment unit is open during normal business hours. Obstetric antenatal clinics are also located on the ground floor. So if you're seeing both a doctor and a midwife in your pregnancy, you will usually see the doctor here, sometimes on the same day of your scan. King's is a research active trust. You may be approached by a research midwife or doctor about taking part in research. Our studies at King's College Hospital are investigating a variety of areas of pregnancy, such as group B strep, diabetes and kidney problems. Participating in research is completely voluntary and any study would be fully explained to you. Some studies involve all women and birthing people automatically via the collection of data. If you would like to opt out of these studies, please speak to your midwife. The Fetal Medicine Centre also operates many research studies. You will always be asked to provide consent before participating. This is a Golden Jubilee Wing, located just behind A&E. You'll find Nightingale Birth Centre up on the fourth floor. It's open 24 hours and for out of hours access, there's a buzzer to the left where a security member will let you through. This is the Nightingale Birth Centre. On arrival, the receptionist will check you in and you'll be seen based on clinical priority. You can always have your birth partner with you. If you're admitted to this ward, we have a multidisciplinary team caring for a wide range of birthing situations. There are midwife-led suites for those experiencing an uncomplicated birth and wishing to have a home-from-home -home experience. In the main labour ward birthing rooms, more complex births will be supported by our team of obstetric doctors, anaesthetists and midwives together. Each room will have a bath or shower en suite. We also offer birth balls and birthing stools to support an active birth. There is also a shared room where inductions of labour are started. Once your labour is established, you will be moved to a labouring room for more privacy. Two obstetric theatres are on the ward for any planned or emergency caesarean sections and instrumental births. Once your baby is born, if you're in a labouring room, you'll stay there for a few hours until you and your baby feel more stable. There is a theatre recovery room, high dependency room and a transitional care room, all designed to provide additional care if your birth was more complicated.
The William Gilliatt Ward provides antenatal and postnatal care for any pregnant clients that require hospital stay or any new mothers or babies that require additional support. We work with our families to empower them in order to provide them information and assistance so that they can make an informed choice about feeding their babies. The care team includes midwives, obstetric doctors, anaesthetists, infant feeding specialists, urogynecology and women's physiotherapy specialists, safeguarding services and more. People usually stay in a four-bedded bay with curtains and a shared bathroom. Under normal visiting circumstances, birthing partners are welcome to stay with you 24 hours a day. You are encouraged to bring everything you need for yourself and baby for your stay on the ward and your midwife can advise on what to pack into your hospital bag. Clinical care includes intravenous antibiotics, iron and blood transfusions, phototherapy light treatment for babies with jaundice, a dedicated transitional care space for babies who need neonatal nursing care, and a small number of private side rooms used for bereavement and infection control isolation. Our care does not stop once you leave King's. One of our community midwives will come and see your home within 24 hours from leaving the hospital. If you live outside King's area, we'll transfer your details to your local community midwives who will take over your care. Your midwives will assess yours and your baby's needs and plan the home visits for the next 10 following days. We look forward to welcoming you to King's College Hospital to facilitate a comfortable and positive birthing experience.